Some Virginia lawmakers are pushing for stricter penalties on those involved in animal cruelty cases. WSLS 10's Patricia Martellotti takes a look at this at the impact this bill could have should it pass. Animals like these that have been abused may soon have a chance at a better life if proposed legislation passes in the General Assembly. The new law would make it a felony to even harm an animal, much tougher than the current standard. They're trying to simply change the code to where if an animal is tortured and suffers um, great injury, great physical suffering, then a person can be charged and convicted of a felony even if the animal is saved and does not die. Deegan believes there is a strong correlation between animal abuse and human violence. I think by strengthening the animal laws, we actually do good for human beings as well because there's so much of a connection between animal cruelty and human violence. Staff members at Angels of Assisi in Roanoke are pleased with the current animal welfare laws in Virginia, but they feel the new laws would be helpful. This will reinforce that and make the laws even better. Workers at Angels of Assisi says they get an average of 100 animal abuse cases every year. This does not include those animal abuse cases that go unreported. Pretty much all the time we're dealing with some type of case or another. Sometimes it's an abandonment case. Um, it varies, but we're on standby every single day. To explain her points, Deegan simply asks, would you rather be shot and killed instantly or locked in a basement to slowly starve to death? That's the degree of suffering, so it, it doesn't make sense that we allow the animals that suffer the most to be just a misdemeanor charge. In Roanoke, Patricia Martellotti, WSLS 10.